Australian football has seen the loss of one of its greatest heroes, and he was Tasmanian, proudly Tasmanian. Daryl Baldock's contribution to football throughout this country is legendary. And while we are saddened by the passing of this giant of our game, we know that his achievements, not only in football, but as the great family man, racehorse trainer and breeder, politician and friend to many, will live on forever. Daryl Baldock, The Doc. Well, I guess my earliest memories are just the stories about how good he was as a junior, like playing at East Devonport when he was, you know, 13 or 14, and when he was coach of East Devonport, senior coach when he was like 19 years of age. Like, try to get a 19-year-old now being senior coach of a footy team, it's almost, you know, you almost can't believe it. Doc was a draw card, you know, and uh, everybody went to see Bulldog play, see how many kicks he'd get. How many goals he kicked? I had the pleasure to coach some of the finest players ever to play the game. Whilst I've never named my best player, um, Daryl Baldock is equal to any player that I have coached. His ability to win the ball under pressure and select the right option and execute it correctly just made him a special player. He had great vision and he had great anticipation. He could read the ball and he presented himself in the right position quicker than any player that I've seen. Daryl Bulldog, I mean, uh, he just shouldn't have been as good as he was because I mean, he, he played at centre-half forward and he was small for a centre-half forward in height. He wasn't, he was fairly broad, uh, had a low centre of gravity, could hardly be knocked off the line of, uh, of the ball. He had beautiful balance, but great reflexes and he knew instinctively where the ball was going. You know, an icon of the game and, you know, probably no bigger name uh, of football in Tasmania and you know, he's a legend in the Australian Football Hall of Fame as well, so just massive, but he's achieved so much more than that. You couldn't wish for, for a better mate. We've had uh, a lot of fun over a lot of years. Uh, we've been in horses together too, which uh, again is a, another achievement that Doc has had, uh, training horses. He's won so many cups with so many different horses, and uh, again, he's a perfectionist in his horse training. Really, if you, if you look at what Doc's done over his career, there's this, it's enormous really what he's, what he's achieved. And it wasn't just footy, you know, his political career, the horse racing, or what he achieved there with all the winners that he trained, and you know, whatever he did, he excelled in, and he's just a legend of a guy.